A saltwater wedge in the Mississippi River has prompted the governor to issue a state of emergency for Plaquemines Parish. What is a saltwater wedge? We've got the science lesson in your breakdown. In short, a well-defined layer of dense saltwater is moving upstream through the Mississippi River from the Gulf underneath less dense fresh water. It's called a wedge because it's moving all together in a distinct flow. And it's a problem because the parish water supply comes from the river. So how does this happen? Typically, the volume of water flowing down the Mississippi River is enough to prevent salt water from heading upstream. But when the river slows down, salt water drifts upstream from the Gulf. Right now, like last year, the Army Corps of Engineers is building an underwater levee of sand to stop the wedge as it heads upstream. There are also tracking the location of the wedge online and it's on the move. Data shows it's moved almost three miles upstream since Thursday, now at Myrtle Grove. In 2012, the wedge made it all the way to Bell Chase. Water and ice are being distributed at the Boothville, Venice and Buris fire stations now because there is a drinking water advisory for Plaquemines Parish below the Empire Bridge.